In this video, I'm gonna show you how to create this linear wipe transition in Premiere Pro. Stick around. Tyler here from Video Editing with Tyler White. And if you wanna learn how to edit video like a pro, start out by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. Here inside Premiere, I already have my two clips down on the timelines. First thing I'm gonna do to create this effect is go up here to the double arrows and go down to effects. I'm gonna type in linear wipe. And then down here under transition, I'm going to drag the linear wipe effect onto video clip number one, because we're gonna be transitioning from video clip one to video clip number two. Then what I'm gonna do is go ahead and drag video number one onto video layer number two and I'm going to drag video number two ever so slightly underneath video number one, having them overlap just a little bit, and we can fine tune this here in just a sec. The next thing I'm gonna do is go ahead and select video layer number one. I'm gonna go down under effects controls here to the linear wipe effect, and let me just kind of further explain what this all means here in the effect. So as far as transition completion, zero is the very beginning of the transition, 100 is gonna be the very end of the transition. You can also play around with the different angles as well as add some feather to make the line a little bit more soft whenever the transition is occurring. So I'm gonna go ahead and reset everything and show you how to animate this transition. So what I like to do is go ahead and make sure that I am making this a little bit bigger. And then I'm at the very beginning of that second video clip. If I wanna put this in the correct spot, what I can also do is toggle this little eye icon here on video layer number two and shift this around to put it whatever spot that I want it to be whenever I go to transition into that second video. But I'm pretty happy with where it's at currently, so I'm just gonna leave it where it is. And then what I'm gonna do is make sure I have that very first video clip selected and I'm gonna be putting my playhead at the very beginning of that second video clip. Then what I'm gonna do is go ahead and select the stopwatch here for transition completion, and I'm gonna go forward five frames. And then I'm gonna go ahead and change this to 100%. And what's going to happen is the transition will go across and transition into video layer number two, just like this. And that looks pretty good. The difference between the linear wipe and a typical wipe transition is the fact that you have the option of being able to feather. So if you want to feather this out, you can. You can also change the angle to which the transition comes from. So I can do it just like this, play it back. That looks good as well. Additionally, what you can do is you can make this a little bit bigger and I can also take this second keyframe and pull it out to the right just a little bit more and it's gonna make my transition a little bit slower so it'll look like this. So you can kind of play around with the distance you want this keyframe from the first keyframe that you made. Know that the closer it is, the faster the transition will be, the further away it is, the longer the transition is going to be. Just know if you take it to the very end of the clip, it will last until the very end of your first video clip moving into that second video clip. And that's it. Continue to perfect your skills by checking out this video. Edit like a pro by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. I'll see you in the next video.